Hello YouTube and welcome back to a new reaction. Today we're back with um, Daisy Johnson reaction of, for her showcase for New Journey. Um, I am so excited at the same time, so scared because I don't know what's going to happen. Um, I don't know who Daisy Johnson is, but um, obviously I'm going to look her up after this and see what she does, how powerful she is. I turned off the chat because the chat is going crazy and... Honestly, I cannot wait. Let's see. Two, one, let's go. Oh my God, I'm so scared. Oh my God, I'm so scared. Daisy Johnson's showcase. Oh. Oh, that's her shield. She got earthquake. Make them unable to use abilities. Oh, so when she does the earthquake, no one can use their abilities. And they get damage? And I see that a lot of damage. Vibration beam. Regular vibration beam that damages the target. Is this like the the one that's beam? They can be stopped. And you can hold it as much as you can. It seems like a vibrational choke. Presses the target throw, making them choke and dealing constant damage. Okay, this is good. This is good. She seems good. But I don't think she's gonna be coins. I think she's gonna be free. I don't know. Her shield kind of gave it away. Vibration push. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> she made her fly. Girl. Vibration charge. I saw this in the thumbnail. It's like... It's like a repulse. I learned how to say it, right? And it pushes everyone around her. They didn't do damage. And this is another repulse. Vibration wave. Mass earthquake. Causes mass damage to nearby players, making them unable to use their abilities. It, didn't we see this before? High jump. Oh my god, she doesn't fly. Oh god, please tell me she flies. Oh! What do you mean, give away? Now, hold on a minute. What do you mean, give away? I better have this, because I swear to God, if I don't have... Please, New Journey, I'm begging you. Give me this. Because if I don't have it, I'm going to be so mad. <laughs> so, Mass Earthquake is like an exclusive ability. That, like, you only have it by a giveaway? And then you got similar ability around here, like the second one, I think, which is an earthquake. Isn't it like the same? I mean, this is called earthquake, but the other one called mass earthquake, and it still hits all of the people nearby. So it doesn't really matter. It just doesn't. If you have, do you have them both when you get the ultimate, like the giveaway? I'm not sure, but I think. Uh, let me give you. My thinking about this character, I think this character is gonna be coins, obviously. At first, when I, show, when I saw her shield, she gave me the free character vibes. But now, it's either between um, uh, coins or Robux. But like, 80% um, it's gonna be coins. That's what I think it is. The shield is good. I mean, it also prevents them from coming to you, but the question is, can they attack you from behind? Because if they can, that shit is sloppy. Just remove that. Because <laughs> I feel like technically, if you are like being real, the shield only is in front of her. So only people who are in front of her are people that she's protected from. But if her shield is like working the same way as Endgame Wanda's shield, then she will definitely be protected from everything. Uh, Earthquake seems like it does a lot of damage, so I'm guessing that kind of like if you have her ultimate, you will also keep this. Um, she doesn't have any telekinetic ability. I didn't see any bolt, which is weird. We only saw a beam, which I'm guessing it works exactly like um, Mom Wanda's or Endgame Wanda's or whatever. It's the beam that you hit the target and then at, at one point they just free and come for you. <laughs> so technically, 
I mean, I saw the beam, it does a lot of damage, so... In a, in a short period of time. Uh, Vibration Choke, this is so good. Um, to have, to combo as well, with other keybinds and stuff like that. Um, what else do we have? Vibration Push, I don't think this is necessary. <laughs> Honestly. I don't think this is necessary, because I don't even know if I'm gonna be close to the character. Oh, maybe... Never mind. If you see a character on the ground, you can push them to like add it to a combo, like the final push where you kill them. Because I'm pretty sure that does a lot of damage. And if you mess it up, let's see if it ragdolls them. If it doesn't ragdolls them, then well, it's useless. They are ragdolled for some time. So if you if you didn't corner them, you pretty much this ability is pretty much useless to you. Vibration charge. I think you hold um, a vibration orb, yeah. And once you release it, it releases a wave that it pushes everyone around you and it does them damage. It also can be useful, um, but this one takes time to work. So I would do it once they are on the ragdoll. And they made it up, or whatever it called. Um, what is it called? They changed it with this um repulse the vibration wave which i think it, it's instant which like cancels the other one and mass earthquake new journey hello hello andre hello myler hello avon um i am your best friend give me this give me this <laughs> and she has high jump which i think it's ridiculous because no one is gonna want to run across the map when everyone is flying so i hope she can also fly because if she can't then well ggs so give me your thoughts in the comments what i think about her keybinds i totally think that she is an offensive um character that has a lot of offense spell i mean offense keybinds and she's gonna be useful in abilities but she also has some down down plays or downsides which is First of all, flying. Second of all, um, no telekinetic ability. And third of all, yeah, that's it. So, yeah, I cannot wait to see this character in game. I cannot wait to see her backstory from the movies that I will watch. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.